Hi, this is Brian from Bee's Music Shop, and I'm here at the 2023 Chicago Vintage and Custom Drum Show, and I'm here with Hans from the Austrian Drumhead Company, and he's going to show us what he brought here today. How's it going, Hans? Hey, I'm doing good. How are you doing? Good. Good. Cool. Yeah, we came all over from Austria, Europe. So, no kangaroos in Austria, you There's know? No, no kangaroos. Right. So, <laughs> we can... a second, but yeah. <laughs> we, we are here from Austria the first time, so we, we've been... Last year for the Chicago Drum Show, just visiting and yeah. uh, meeting people. So this year we came with our booth from the Austrian Drumhead Company. That's incredible, and this is a huge enthusiast for for uh, you know regular animal hide heads. So I'm sure it's you're getting a huge response here. But why don't you show us what you got here? Of course, we have uh, calfskin drum heads, and over here we have a goat skin, 14 inch for for snare drum. So we do different thicknesses. We have, for example, here we have a medium yeah. on that drum. We have a thin over here. And what we also do is no, actually, Zach, we're doing the Rezo heads for snare drum, which yeah. are even more thinner than the thin ones to get a really crispy sound out of your snare wires, right? Yeah, that's great. I mean, how did you guys get into doing you know, calf skin and goat skin heads. I mean, that's tucking and all that stuff is quite a process, you know? Right, it is. So I spent, uh, so I got interested in calf skin drum heads uh, a few years ago when I did classic percussion a lot. Yeah, yeah. So I started tucking old heads on some cutout uh, hoops from any head, so uh, doing that. Yeah, and then I started to make this uh, wooden flash hoops. They yeah. are made of beadwood. Oh, okay. Yeah, from Austria. And doing that and tucking the heads, and it's really fun. Yeah. I'm really enjoying it. It's a, it's a, I've done banjo repair, and tucking heads is, a, it's an art. And I, I right. give it out to you to do it every day. It's, it's not easy work, you know, and, it, and these look fantastic. I mean, you can tell they're really attention to detail is great. Um, can we yeah. can we hear a few of these and hear what the of sounds course, like? Of course, yeah, yeah, of course. So, Maria is giving you an idea. Yeah, yeah, as as you can good. hear, they're like very dynamic. Yeah. Um, yeah. Right, yeah. This sounds good. Yeah, let's hear the go. Nice, nice. That sounds great. And then this is the thinnest head, right? Yes. Right. So we have the thin on top and the rizo head on bottom. Nice. So is this one a is is this one a traditional or a, a right. not traditional? I mean this it's is a traditional. Minor, it's yeah. a minor plastic modern, head. Modern yeah. plastic head. And here we have uh, calf on both sides. All right, let's hear that. Oh, you but do the brushes. Play, yeah, if you do have brushes on this guy. That's incredible. I could listen to you do that all day, so uh, that's, that's... We are here all day. Yeah, yeah, so. yeah, yeah. I might come back just to, just to hear that. So yeah, that, that sounds great. And you also have this uh, full kit set up with a Right, well, yeah, so. we have a 22 kick drum here with our head on it. Oh. We have a 16 inch or 13 inch. We have a... So they are all medium and we have a medium on that snare drum as well. Yeah, let's, let's hear that. Sounds incredible. Well, thanks, Hans. I really appreciate you showing us around. Thank thanks you. For coming. Have right. a good show. You too. Thank you.